Hello guys, it's Taylor. Welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you're new here. My camera is about to die and I want to film an unboxing really quickly so I might talk a little fast in this intro. But I'm starting off a new vlog. I am 28, almost 29 weeks pregnant and tomorrow is actually my glucose test and I'm doing another ultrasound tomorrow to finish up stuff they couldn't get in the um, anatomy scan at 20 weeks so I figured I'd vlog this week. And I just had two packages come in that are baby related, so I wanted to start off the vlog with those. I think the lighting is so bad. I moved the camera to get a little bit better lighting, and obviously the nursery is a mess behind me, but I just got home from student teaching hours, so I'm a little, I think, out of breath. I don't know. Our first package is from H&M. I actually love H&M for, like, adult clothes, um, and we don't have an H&M in my area so I bought some stuff online which I've said this before I'm trying not to buy too much baby stuff um because I know I'm gonna get like a bunch of stuff at the shower like clothes and whatnot but I'm not gonna lie like part of the fun of being a first time mom is like getting to shop for the baby so I let myself buy a few little things um not all clothing related so first thing we got was this little sunshine pillow literally so cute um Make sure it's like a mirror on the back. It's technically a toy, but yeah, that was cute. Then we got these cute little socks. Um, I don't know. I'm assuming people will probably get me socks at the baby shower because people love to buy like clothes and stuff. But if not, I really don't have, I don't think I have any socks at all. And I just saw these, they were on sale. And they're just like neutral, basic little socks. So I got those. I kept getting an ad for this outfit and I thought it was like the cutest thing in the world so i got this little outfit literally how cute is this and i got this in six to nine months then i got baby's first swimsuit look at these little swim trunks you guys they are so cute they're like a sea foam little striped swim shorts um and i got these in a two to six months which obviously he's gonna be born in the summertime and no, I'm not gonna put him in the pool or whatever. But um, if we do, you know, go to the beach or go to the pool or whatever, he's gonna have a little swimsuit. And I just thought it was so cute. I also got him a little sun hat or technically it's a bucket hat, but it has like the little strings and whatnot. And I literally am obsessed with bucket hats. I think they're the cutest thing in the world and this one sell for like three dollars or something so picked up that i then got a sun blanket <laughs> which of course this is just a muslin little blanket and obviously the nursery theme is like sunshine and yeah i thought this would be cute either for like pictures and then also just like as a decor whether it's like over the crib or something and obviously we'll use it as well but yeah then i got this little hooded towel which is also really cute we don't have any towels either which i know that we'll probably get some again at the baby shower but can you really have too many towels no so this is like a little hooded one that i thought was so cute so my camera's on two percent i have one more thing to show you guys from each of them and this is another outfit and this one is so freaking cute it's a little winnie the pooh outfit if i can get it all untucked and whatnot like literally how precious is that i'm not a big character person i'm not a big like disney fan i'm not a big like any of that but winnie the pooh i feel like it's a classic obviously and i will be getting like some stuff like that but i'm not a huge like disney like i know some people are like huge like disney people or like movies and stuff like that i personally am not so that's really like the only character type thing that i've bought so far it's just not really i don't know my husband is a big disney fan but i am not i don't know why that might change now that i'm gonna have a baby maybe i'll watch more movies and get into it but yeah my camera's on one percent i want to show you guys another package so we're gonna tra transfer over my iphone footage for the next few clips i'll go charge my camera okay so this is actually a package i bought off of facebook um i'm in like a pink blush maternity facebook resale group um, and Pink Blush is just like a maternity website. I just cut the wall. <laughs> Anyways, and I was looking for a baby shower dress. And I really wanted this dress. But I didn't want to pay full price for it because it's really expensive. 
and I'll probably only wear it for my baby shower. Um, like I probably won't ever wear it, wear it again. So hopefully this fits because I can't return it. I bought it off somebody, but I just got this like blue dress. I'll probably show, try it on and show you guys, but just like a longer blue dress. It's very simple. And then the top is just like this. And yeah, I wanted it in, that's my cat. Freaking big fat head. I wanted it in like a beige or a light yellow because we're doing Here Comes the Sun theme for the baby shower. But she ended up reselling it in blue for I think literally half the price. You won't get his head out of here. Um, half the price. So really not a big deal. And let me look at this. <laughs> All right, I have the dress on. Don't mind my unmade bed i literally rolled out of bed to go to school this morning obviously i need to get a different bra um you can tell the people i'm wearing a black bra right now it's actually the only regular bra i have that fits so i need to get like a nude because i'm definitely wearing a normal bra especially because the boob situation is boobing right now so yeah the straps and everything will be covered and then this is it i really like it it's really cute and like flowy but I don't look that pregnant like in it um my shower is at the end of may so i'll be 31 weeks pregnant which i know is not <clears throat> like i don't know i think like i should like look bigger in the dress like even from the side it's just kind of like like i have to like go like this for you to be like able to tell but i also i don't know i still have say the day i'm filming this clip is like seventh so i still have like 20 something days or 30 20 something i don't know whatever because my shower is the 30th so i don't know i think it's cute though and i like the color of it i like the fit surprisingly my boobs i was really worried that it was gonna be a lot of boobs but i don't think it will be and then you can like tie this accordingly so yeah i guess i can show you guys in this is the length of the dress as well. And I think with some cute like wedges or something. And then I'd probably wear my hair like a half up, half down. I'm also getting my hair dyed. I literally hate the way it looks right now. Um, my hair appointment is in two weeks. So yeah, I think that I'm probably gonna end up keeping this. We're out shopping for baby stuff. I just got this mirror. The sun is gonna blind you, but um to hang up in the nursery and then i got some other stuff at target i'll show you guys later we just went to old navy because i had super cash expiring today and i should not have gone because i ended up spending so much more money than i needed to okay i'm just gonna show you guys this way because i have no way to hold up this stuff but first off i'm really trying not to buy clothes i'm like i know he's gonna have way too many but my husband really wanted to buy this and i to be fair have been buying everything so I was like, you know what? He picked it out. We'll let him get it. It's really cute. It's this little short and shirt set. And I literally cannot wait. It's so cute. They also have these little boat shoes I wanted to get that would match it. But I chose to wait because I knew I was going to get more super cash. And I'll just hopefully get them next time. I picked out this little shirt. This is the cutest thing I have ever seen in my life. Like literally the cutest thing. And then we got two of the little sleepers which everyone talks about the little navy ones they zip all the way down they have like the um cover for the oh my god i can't think of the word hands but i think i've i think i've said we have a bunch of clothes but we don't have a bunch of like sleepers or like nighty whatever you want to call them things that he'll physically be sleeping in um so i went ahead and picked up two of them i just got a green one and a blue one they were on sale for nine dollars um, and yeah, after the shower, I got a $40 off a hundred cash for next month. And my shower's at the end of this month. So I think that's perfect timing. Cause then if I still need a bunch of like sleepers and stuff, I can just use that. So yeah, I just wanted to show you guys that real quick.
good. We finally have some updates. It's a few days later since I filmed the last clip in here. Um, but we have some big updates to share you guys, share with you guys. And I also, we bought the crib last night and I'm so excited. So I'm hoping that we get to build it tonight, depending on what time my husband gets off. Sometimes he gets off early, sometimes he doesn't. I also kind of want to go for a walk since like daylight saving time. We can finally go at like sunset walks again and I'm trying to walk as much as possible because obviously I'm trying to stay active but I showed you guys hanging up the mirror and everything and I just love the way that it looks I feel like it put the room together so much more like it finally feels like it's starting to like come together and then I think once the crib is built it's gonna feel so like obviously there's still so much I want to do but that like is like the main pieces was like the, the crib and the dress the crib and the dresser <clears throat> Mr. Leo is sitting in the rocking chair. <laughs> but we ended up buying the crib. We didn't originally have a crib on our registry, but we were in Walmart last week and they had a nicer crib, or like a crib that I liked even more than the one on the registry. Well, okay, it's hard to say that because one of the registry was off of like a website where I didn't see it in person. But then I saw this one in Walmart and I just liked the way that it looked um, a lot more. And I thought it was on sale according to the ticket it said it was so we went back to get it and then it was actually full price but it's whatever my husband went by himself and like didn't say anything and i was like whatever it's still whatever um so we took it off the registry we ended up just buying it ourselves so i'm excited to have it all put together and this is crazy but let's show you guys all the updates and whatnot we finally got another bookshelf to not finish the closet, but like set it up. So now we have three bookshelves in here and I'm really excited to start like organizing it. So as you can tell, we hung tension rods right there and right there. So I'm gonna take out the shelves and we're gonna hang clothes there and there. I think I'm gonna do like two tension rods, but I'm waiting until after the shower to see how much clothes people bought us because if we have like way too many, then obviously we'll need more like rods but if not i also plan on storing like like if we have any clothes that are like 9 to 12 or 12 to 18 months like any of that i plan on putting like a store we have a storage bag and just storing at the top of the closet because there's no need to have that like out and taking up space right now so yeah once we do the shower and i can like sort through all the clothes see what we have what we still need and all of that then i'll kind of decide how i'm gonna organize this so yeah but right now the shower is like two weeks away or like less than two weeks away today's like what the 12th and my shower is on the 30th which is crazy by the time you guys are watching this it's probably like a week away because i still have two videos i need to upload before this one goes up um, i'm kind of behind but i have a quick little baby haul just two three things i think i just got some more stuff this came off my registry um from someone who is not coming to my shower obviously so people who aren't coming to my shower for the most part are sending gifts just straight to my house in north carolina um so i'm just getting like random like things here and there so i did get the little free the baby control for the bath so this came out to show you guys and i actually bought a camera and a sock so i bought the owlet camera monitor um, and then the owl sock as well is in here. I did buy them secondhand, which is why there's no packaging on this one. But I bought them on Facebook Marketplace. And yeah, so I have the sock and the camera now, which will be nice. And then obviously you saw over here, we set up the dresser and the mirror. I just love the way this is coming together. I feel like the mirror really tied in because like the wood on it is the same wood as the dresser doorknobs also let's do a little bump check currently 29 weeks pregnant and yeah i set up this diaper caddy we're actually not keeping this one in here um i'm pretty sure this is the one that we're gonna keep downstairs and i also didn't set it up i just didn't want this stuff to be like falling over the closet so it's just kind of like smaller things but obviously i'll organize it and like diaper samples but yeah i want to get like a wooden like diaper caddy to put there because it'll match better and then we'll have the changing pad right there but that kind of gives the vibe of like what it's going to be like and then i'm trying to figure out what i want to hang on these like the wall and over here i know i want to do like a library over here maybe like a play mat on the floor so yeah like there's still a lot to do but also it feels like so much has gotten done so yeah i just wanted to give you guys some quick nursery updates 
I feel like this vlog is getting <laughs> really long. So I think I'm gonna cut it off here. Um, if we end up building the crib tonight, I'll just start my next vlog, my next nursery vlog, nesting vlog, whatever. And I will see you guys in my next one.